Well, we have been having a little uh, struggle in our service reception, and so we were looking to stabilize in that department. I think we did pretty well, and then the, uh, the Italians were doing a really nice job of just bringing smoke because it's really uh, getting a lot of hard jump spin serves. We don't see that much in our gym because we're so much float, jump float, so it took our pastors a little while to adjust, and eventually they, they, uh, they made some uh, just controlled those hard serves in the way that we needed to. What about Kelsey made her right for that role? Because she's a world-class receiver. Uh, she was one of the best passers at the Rio Olympics. This is actually the first competition, even though it's almost two years later, it's the first competition that she's gotten to play for us. Because she had some rest in the early part of 2017 and then had a a scheduling conflict and couldn't play with us at Grand Champions last year in September, so we're excited to have her back in the fall. Just at the end of the week, what were your overall thoughts of, of how your team performed? What did you like and what do you need, know needs improved? Uh, I really like the way we battled back yesterday, down 2-0. We got to 14-all. We had a free ball to go up 15-14. Can't ask for much more than that. I like our chances when we do that. Just Turkey made a couple of good plays. So. Uh, all 14 of our players were making contributions, whether they were on the court or not. So uh, that's something that we pride ourselves in, that we we win together and lose together. And, um, and we're much more powerful as a group of 14. Uh, nobody's tough alone. What did you see from Tori that put, you, put her back in the lineup again tonight? Well, I think all of our middles have done a really nice job here. We could have started with any combination. Um, certainly, Faluka has been doing this thing. Uh, she's got incredible experience having played two Olympic Games now. She's the, the most knowledgeable of, of our middles. But we could have put anybody out there. We happened to go with Tori tonight. But I can see the, the playing opportunities um, shared quite a bit going forward in this in this. Uh, next four weeks of Volleyball Nations League. Can you talk a little bit about the upcoming week in um, Japan? Yes, we're uh, on the bus in, at 4.20 a.m. tomorrow morning. And we're going to take a flight to Denver and then on to Japan. And we're going to play three great team, three more great teams there with Japan. And then our great friend, former USA assistant coach for the last four years, Jamie Morrison, who's now the head coach of Netherlands. We get to play him and his team. Uh, and then we'll also play Belgium. So three great tests again next week. Japan plays a very different style. That's one of the beautiful things about women's international volleyball is from team to team, country to country, there are incredibly different styles. It's uh, uh, much more fun to follow and challenging for all of us because we have to make adjustments from one match to the next.